Well, the, a very busy afternoon of field events and uh, the long jump men a little earlier on. Tobias Montler, well, he uh, last year when the final three was first trialed, he had been leading and going at the final round and he'd lost in the end. Uh, this time he started very well, 8.20 in round two, round one, then 8.23, a new personal best for him in round two. Now, the world champion, Tajay Gale, notoriously sometimes takes a little while to get going to. No jumps in the first two rounds, then in the third round, finally getting himself out. Uh, sorry, a little bit later on, did 8.20, then 8.27, the season's best. But from the first five rounds, the furthest jump came from this man, Ekevaria, who we would have expected to be the pre-event favourite, although Gale has the opportunity, always has the opportunity of the big jumps, doesn't he? So there you go, wasn't much between them. 8.29, 8.27, 8.23, very good long jumping. And the uh, wind was following them and occasionally was gusting, as Tim was mentioning earlier on, above the legal limit of plus two. Now, Montler, as I said last year, did lead and, until he came into the final three and lost out to Samai. Can he turn the tables this time? He's in third place, he goes first. Montler. Final jump of the competition. Oh, he's gone for it, but that might get a red. Yes, it gets a red flag. That's a shame for the Swede. I'm sure, though, he'll be very happy with an 8.23. Person best by just one centimetre for him in round two. So the world champion has warmed to this competition. Sometimes doesn't get his run up quite right. He's he's such. You watch this when he uh, gets his speed going. The height he gets off the board as well. Tajay Gale of Jamaica. Here he goes. Oh, that's a <laughs> well. You'd expect the long jump in the long jump. The flag goes up now. That flag is breezing. We've seen the last two three jumps be over, and you've just seen there. You just saw a little glimpse of a flag. Waving in the wind means it's over, plus 2.3, but 8.55 for Tajay Gale. That is huge, only just over the legal limit of plus 2.3. It's over to you, Ekevaria. Final jump. Just a little stut on his run-up there, perhaps. He's had real problems with the run-up. Was way behind the board again, way behind the board. Well... Ekevaria, 8.19, he must have been 20, 30 centimetres behind the board there, but not good enough, 8.55, Tajay Gale, the world champion, coming out on top, huge performance from him, although it was, as I said, windy in the sense of a plus 2.3.